Hello, this is Buona from Buona.tv, and today I want to talk about TweetTree. TweetTree is a front end for Twitter.com, which allows you to do some nifty things that you can't do from the website itself. Uh, one of the things that TweetTree can do is that it can basically show you your conversations in a threaded view, so you can see who replied to what in some cases. Now, Twitter is, you know, by the nature of how Twitter is built, there's only certain ways you can you can alleviate this problem because you know so, so if I send you a tweet today and you reply three days from now there's no way that Twitter or even TweetTree can know but it does its best to try to maintain the context and see and I'll show you how that looks like what that looks like in a minute it also supports inline media and I think this is a very very exciting um, if you embed a URL uh, a, a Twitter I'm sorry a YouTube URL a Flickr TwitPic, FriendFeed, Seismic, any of these services if you post a link in a tweet Tweet tree will show the actual media. So I'm going to go ahead and log in so you can see what it looks like. And you just have to supply your username and password. And what it does is that it goes to Twitter and it gets your profile. So this is my actual Twitter background that I have on Twitter.com. And uh, it has all my users and everything. As you can see, it, it already has some threading that's going on here. So this is pretty nice. And uh, it's, it's pleasing to the eye. And you can easily see some of the context that's going on now you'll notice some friend feed things happening here this is some this is an example of some of the inline media and uh, here's a quick video as well so these people posted links to these services and TweetTree automatically shows them within the page itself so to get a quick overview of how things look just go to the search bar and search for the desired service so say I want to see what a YouTube video looks like on TweetTree I can just go up here and search for YouTube and nine times out of ten, I'm going to find somebody who posted a YouTube link, and there's one right there. There's some more here. So, um, Tweet Tree in a nutshell is very, very nice. I like the interface. There are some things that are missing. For example, you can't access your direct messages on Twitter. Uh, you also have limited capability with your replies. Now, they do have an at me link here, which will perform a search for your name. So you can see some of your replies. But if you've ever been to Twitter.com, you know that they have a dedicated reply section. So that, that's kind of their workaround for that. But overall, I think it's a, it's a pretty good deal. Um, so just go to TweetTree.com. That's with one T. Uh, I made that mistake a couple of times. Just go to TweetTree.com and uh, just check out what they have here. And there's, there's Nate showing off his beard there. Uh, that's a Twit pick that, that came up. So that's actually some nice stuff. Here's a seismic video. That was posted the other day. And you can see Seismic. If you've ever used Seismic, you know it's a good way to have video conversations. So that was a reply to something I posted the other day. All right. So that's pretty much it. You can see uh, all of the different uh, conversations in line right here and threaded. So go to TweetTree.com today. You can check it out. Um, I think it's I think it's a nice I think it's a nice front end for Twitter, and uh, I don't know if it's going to replace Twitter.com for a lot of people, but I, th I think it provides a fresh alternative, and the inline media really makes it attractive and changes the Twitter experience. All right, this is Buona from Buona.tv, and that is TweetTree.com. Enjoy.